This is a mustard sauce review. So if you saw my last video, I made some mustard sauce um, recipes in the video. Um, this is pate pork with an egg and about a tablespoon of uh, sour cream. And then we've got some cheese here, raw cheese, uh, Colby if you care, or maybe it's cheddar, I don't even remember. And then I also got uh, three oysters today. Uh, as you can see, they're getting bigger. It's a good time to get oysters. Um, What's funny though is this one's almost twice as big as this one, but the oyster meat's the same size. And I bought an oyster knife finally. There it is. And uh, the lady said, oh, it's a good idea you bought that. I mean, I was just using a butter knife before, and um, it was working for some of them, but even one of these, the, um, the nook wasn't very stable. And um, like this top shell oyster just like, it flew off and made a mess and that was the first oyster i tried to open too thankfully the other two came open pretty easy um but you know if you just take like a hammer or a rock or something and you uh you know smash it at an angle so you're almost uh like twisting it's like a like a really forced twisting you can get the top half or the bottom half off of the oyster and then pry it open that way if um, you can't get a good hold for a knife or something. Good old uh, nature tricks. So, yeah. Bought the oyster knife. I'll probably eat some more oysters this winter. So, yeah, oysters are a real good cl palate cleanser. And they can help you um, eat more meat. Uh, they're also really good for pulling deep seated mercury. So, okay, so over here, got that mustard sauce on there. I put about uh, two teaspoons of honey as well because this sauce is very it has a lot of bite to it it's very spicy and um i like spicy um but i i also like flavor too it's it's very overpowering i put some with the ketchup because the ketchup recipe calls for it and i honestly prefer the ketchup without the mustard sauce um just my uh my personal taste preference um because the ketchup without the mustard it doesn't have the bite it's a little less sweet but if you add in the onions it kind of rounds it out especially I find the ketchup I made with the spicy pepper the Bangalore tail whip or whatever or the, whatever it was called that was better ketchup with onions and everything else in there no mustard because it had a smoky flavor um, you know it wasn't spicy it wasn't hot but it uh, you know, it was really good. It rounded out the flavors really well. Anyway, so, you know, I've got this basically honey mustard on here. Let's give it a try. Okay. And this mustard sauce, a little bit goes a long way, honestly. So you really don't need that much. Um, I think it calls for like 10 servings for one recipe. You know, you could probably get 15 at least, honestly. All right, so here we go. Okay, yeah, that's a lot better. I wasn't adding a lot of honey, or I didn't add the maximum amount of honey in the recipe, which was two tablespoons per, you know, batch. And I just added more honey on the meat with the uh, sauce. And I feel like that's better, because you get a little more sweet, because you, you don't want to add too much honey to the mustard you know and you don't want to add too much honey to your meat either you know you want to keep it to a tablespoon max so this is probably a tablespoon maybe just a little under counting the two tablespoons plus the amount of honey that was in the mustard sauce so uh oh yeah see i cut myself a little bit on that oyster too you know oysters are sharp so be careful um you know so i got some milk here you know half a cup of milk with meat meals this is unrefrigerated milk sip it it's very good um so yeah you know i'm gonna eat those oysters um i'll probably get some more butter that's what's missing i forgot to get butter so you know i'll get like a tablespoon of butter between that and the tablespoon of cream in here plus the egg and i'll probably get some more eggs too i like to I like to eat a little bit of meat, take a break, suck down an egg, and then I'll 
like let it digest and then I'll go back to eating again. That's just how I eat um, most days. Some days I shovel it all down, some days I don't. Um, but I think eggs are really good with uh, meat meals because they'll provide the body energy. Um, so that way your body is using the meat more for rebuilding that energy. And, and you know that's any raw fat but the eggs are very easily utilized so I, I like to eat eggs throughout my meat meal um, so yeah the mustard sauce let's give it another taste um, yeah you don't need a lot you know you really can spread it out over the mustard or the the ketchup isn't as strong I like a lot of ketchup well, you don't need a lot of mustard so the mustard is really good if you um you know you like a little bit of something you know, like something spicier you know it's definitely got that going for it um spicy and sweet too if you add you know up to the recommended amount of honey a tablespoon so you know if you haven't tried mustard or ketchup or sauces you really should they can make a meat meal a lot more easy to eat sometimes especially if you're you know sick of eating the same thing you know if you're on a budget or whatever it really helps change things up and taste good as well i wouldn't be too worried about the you know whatever in seeds these seeds um i didn't have any problems with them and i ate a lot of mustard yesterday um you know like i put on like three times the amount i did here but i ate twice as much meat and i didn't have any stomach problems whatsoever i was i was expecting it to happen because of how spicy it was but it didn't happen and I wasn't even drinking milk with it so you know it's it's not like other spicy stuff where like oh I'm gonna feel this later that's not the case with this so um, you know enjoy your mustard and uh, give it a shot if you haven't